Only minutes after a shooting, security cameras captured the getaway vehicles in Durban neighborhood. According to inside information from numerous police sources, this is how the inquiry into the death of Africa's biggest musician, aka got underway. A white Mercedes Benz thought to have been used at the getaway vehicles on the night of aka's mother was discovered in one of Durban's townships. The vehicle was also allegedly discovered for evidence and fingerprints, as well as DNA sample. According to a source close to the investigation, an airtime slip was located in the vehicles and belonged to one of Forbes' alleged killers. Authorities utilized that slip to track down the killer's girlfriend, and once they did, they discovered that one of the killers was tied to Mpangen. They followed the girlfriend and questioned her. Crane and Forbes, a larger-than-life South African hip-hop icon known as by his stage. Name and his fans as AKA was brutal murdered on Florida roads in Durban on February 10. One African most famous and bassiest entertainment strips and tourist destination visited by thousands of people from all over the world. Forbes alleged killers are scheduled to appeal in court around a month and a half later. On Tuesday morning the four alleged murdered of Forbes were taking approximately 1,500 kilometers back to Durban from Cape Town. Central Police Station. The weekend urges in the mother city exclusively revealed on Tuesday that the suspects were being kept in jail at the Cape Town Central Police Station following the arrest of three of them in Belha on Sunday. The crew notified one of the suspects closed in an orange jumpsuit getting into one of the accompanying van. It is known when four suspects were apprehended. The Sunday Tribune broke the story over the weekend. The newspaper first reported at least three men had been arrested in in connection with the murder of Forbes and his buddy Mushwane. Colonel Andre Trout, a Western Cape police spokesperson, said it was a KZN case and referred to the publication of KZN police. When contacted KZN police spokesperson Colonel Robert Nesunda stated that no update on the Forbes investigation had been received. Neither the Western Cape nor KZN police have acknowledged the event of Sunday when three suspects were claimed to be a police custard following the arrest at the Cape Town town retail. Center. The accused were arrested and questioned. The murder were caught on CCTV, which quickly went viral on social media. During the last week, media reported that the right SAPS squad are tracked down the three suspects in Eureka Square in Belka on Sunday. They also stated in their most recent reports that undercover cops had apprehended the suspect at an ATM in Belka. According to the media report, one of the accused is related to an run of cabo homicide in Mpangeni. Following the February murders, investigators had been tracking the alleged hitman for weeks, according to media report.